हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल यू ऑल नो दैट वी आर डूइंग टॉपिकल बेस्ड क्वेश्चन सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल गो थ्रू द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम फंक्शंस सो आई विल ट्राई टू कवर अप ऑल काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन दैट कैन बी आस्ट इन द पेपर्स सो लेट स्टार्ट हेयर वी हैव फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन हेयर हेयर इज अ फंक्शन एक्स maps to 10x plus 2 fill in the missing number so you see here we have like if you put 3 the answer is 32 so uh, your x this is input x is input then output is this one so this one is input this is output i'll try to explain you the method how it works actually so like this one here when you uh, had input x here Uh, by three, then this is you see thirty plus two. It is thirty-two. Now here we will do the same. Ten times four plus two. So this is forty plus two. Answer will be forty-two. It's just like you are replacing the value of x by the given number. Now this will be inverse mapping, reverse of the function. so that means now your input now your 10x plus 2 and this value is now 2 right so you are going to do the reverse process here so if you do reverse process here so 10x will be 2 minus 2 which is 0 so divide by 10 divide by 10 this is x here and this will be 0 so this is going to be zero so you can check this one like let's say 10 times 0 from here plus 2 so this is 0 plus 2 you will have answer 2 in the final here we have another question which is very simple write down the inverse of this function now you see y is equal to uh, 2 times x right so reverse of so times that means uh, we have y is 2 times x now the inverse is like the opposite of this uh, to undo this so that means y will be 2 divided by x so 2 divided by x before we do this question i would request you guys to subscribe to my channel and press the like button if you like the content and the video and share the channel with your friends now this table shows some outcomes from the function x to uh, 2x uh, plus 3 so now if you see this one here we have the input as i told you input and then this is output output is 2x plus 3 input is x so if you replace x by this value you are going to get this one so here we have 2x plus 3 so value of x is 6 so 2 times 6 plus 3 which is 12 12 plus 3 it is going to be 15 the other one you have here 2x plus 3 now the value of x is 9 right plus 3 2 times 9 is 18 18 plus 3 is 21 here we have bit different question uh, temperature can be measured in uh, degrees in degree celsius or degree fahrenheit uh, here is the function to change degree celsius to degree fahrenheit uh, so c degree celsius times 1.8 plus 32 then that will convert into fahrenheit so use this function to change 25 degrees to this one so 25 degree celsius we are going to multiply it by 1.8 then we are going to add by 32 that will give you the final answer so let's see 25 times 18 8 times 540 20 then 25 it's 450 so this is going to be 450 plus 32 so 450 plus 32 is 482 so 482 
is the final answer for this one and next we have complete the inverse function so inverse function we are going to do the reverse process of this so this was from celsius to fahrenheit now we have fahrenheit to uh, celsius so we will start from here so you have plus 32 here so we are going to do minus 32 then it was times 1.8 you are going to divide it by 1.8 we are taking the opposite of that right i hope you guys understood this one here is another kind of question uh, angelic finds coordinates on a straight line y equals to 2x plus 4 she finds x coordinate from the given y coordinate draw a ring around the correct function to uh, find x so, so to find x what will we have here from here how will you find out x let me write it down here we have y equals to 2x plus 4 so what we are going to do first shifting x i mean uh, shifting all other things except uh, x from this side so if i just write it down like this i hope you guys are okay with this so because both sides are equal i'm just writing this here now shift 4 to other side that will become this is positive it will become minus 4 here then divide by 2 divide by 2 and i will write here divide by 2 like this so then x is equal to y minus 4 divided by 4 uh, 2 so which option do you see here so this one we need to put ring around this one so that's how another kind of functions question can be asked another question with diagram seems interesting uh, write an algebraic expression for each function machine one has been done for you so we have here n n times 3 gives you 3n now we have n plus 4 n plus 4 very simple you're just going to uh, follow the instructions then n times 5 and then minus 3 n times 5 is 5n minus 3 you see it's easy just follow the instructions whatever is told to do that thing here uh, now complete the function machine for the statement below Hassan thinks of a number so let's say that number is n he divides the number by 4 and then adds he divides divides the number by 4 so divided by 4 then adds 2 the answer is 7 so it's done now work out the number Hassan was thinking in part V. So we are going to find out this number. So you have here n divided by 4 and then added 2 answer is 7. So I have written this as an equation. So this is n divided by 4 then 7 shift to the other side this one here it will become negative. So n over 4 7 minus 2 is 5. So I've just written here n over, over 4. So to remove this 4, we will multiply both sides by uh, 4. So n is equal to 20. So answer is 20. So we can check this one like n divided by 4. So 20 divided by 4 is 5. 5 plus 2 is 7. So you can even check your answer if it's correct or not. Find inverse function of this y is equal to 3 times x, right? So inverse is going to be the reverse process of that. So that means y is equal to 3 divided by x. Or we can write it down y is equal to 3 over x. y is equal to 3 over x. Uh, that's all for functions right now that I have. So, I can't find other questions. If I find other good questions on functions, then I will make another video. So, I hope you guys understood everything. So, please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends. And let me know in the comment section if there is any question or anything or any other topic you want me to do. Thank you so much guys. God bless you.